In 1666, Isaac Newton split light with the prism. Then, in 1917, Ernest Rutherford split the atom. And now, in 2018, EMK have performed the most epic split ever since the 2013 Volvo Van Dam. Ladies and gentlemen, I give you the triple-ended optical cable. Welcome to the future. Hi, I'm Sam Tucker and welcome to another Honest Unboxing. Very special episode today because we got sent in some audio cables from EMK, some very fancy ones. In particular, the triple-ended, the triple-pronged optical cable. Now, this seems to be an exclusive to EMK. Uh, I'm pretty sure no other manufacturer, not that I could find, uh, actually make this cable. Maybe for a reason, or maybe because they're gutless, and EMK is the only one brave enough to, uh, to take on the challenge of the triple-pronged optical cable. So first of all, if you don't know, optical cables, they work a little bit differently from your standard uh, component cables, or your, even your USBs, or heck, your HDMIs, uh, because they don't send an electrical signal down a wire. Instead, these send little light signals, or like little laser beams, down what is effectively glass, like a little optical fiber inside the tube here. It's the same sort of stuff that they've got running on the ocean floor to send some sweet, sweet internet around the world. And we should really get the shark away from that. Someone get the shark away from the internet, please. What was that, a great white? Oh, an Article 13 shark. <laughs> anyway, back to the cables. I'm not entirely sure why sound needs to travel at the speed of light. All I know is you get some sweet surround sound with this sort of cable. And I'll tell you what, EMK have gone the extra mile because on the end, the connector actually is made of 24 karat plated gold, which in no way affects the light signal going down the cable, but it, it just shows you the, the effort they've gone to here. You could call it a sound investment. Mm. So what makes the cable so special? Let me show you. Okay, so basically you'd use the triple prong cable if say you have a PlayStation and an Xbox that you want to plug into your surround sound system without having to keep swapping around cables. You know, you're gonna play your PlayStation, boop, surround sound deliciousness, Xbox, boom, surround sound deliciousness. Very important not to actually have these turned on at the same time or else you're gonna cross your streams. And geez, while that may have worked for the Ghostbusters, when the Mythbusters crossed their stream with an electric fence, it nearly blew their dick off. So be careful. And of course, if you are utterly insane, I guess you could do it the other way where you connect one PlayStation up to uh, two sound systems uh, but at that point, you've freaking created an alternate timeline with freaking Biff's president. You've gone too far. Okay, that's enough talk about the corkboard continuum. Let's just see if this works in the real world. Let's go plug it in and just see what happens. All right, here we go. We got our surround sound system here. Let's test it out with my PlayStation 4 and my Xbox One. Yes, it, it's the one. I'm not cheap. Shut up. All right, here we go. We plug one end into the surround sound system, another prong directly into the PlayStation, and the third into the Xbox One. All right, let's test it out with the game with my favorite Fallout 4. Let's put it in, see if it works. Booyah, okay, that seems to work. Now let's turn that off and test out the Xbox with my second favorite Fallout 3. Oh yes, it works, and I didn't have to move any cables at all. Let's try out some music. On the PlayStation, we'll try out some Joe Cocker. Oh, that's some sweet Cocker. All right, pause that. Now on the Xbox, try some pink. Yeah, baby. All right, now we gotta do it. EMK specifically warn not to cross the streams, but I tell ya, we're gonna find out what happens if we play Joe Cocker on the PlayStation and Pink on the Xbox at the same time. Oh, 
Well, how about that? You get some pink cocker. Well, 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 I can't believe it, but they've pulled it off. Yes, the triple pronged cable works in the best way possible as advertised. This is real courage in the tech industry and they do seem like really good quality. So you know what? I recommend it for the very niche uh, people who this cable is perfect for. I will say if your TV does have an optical out on its own, you're probably better off plugging your consoles into your TV and then optical out your TV to the receiver. But that's why EMK also sell the single pronged optical cable. <laughs> What are you aiming for? They got pretty much any cable you could want, like uh, this one, where you can plug your smartphone or your Blackberry into uh, your sound system there. Or if you're feeling a little bit kinky, why not get this uh, little audio cable that has a 90 degree kink in its dongle? Check out the links in the description. They got USBs, they got pretty much everything. This one even comes with a strap on. One silly thing that I actually like about these cables is they actually come in these Ziploc bags because I think, like a lot of people, I actually have stowed away in the cupboard a big uh, tangled mess of depression and it, it makes me sad every time uh, I try and get a cable from that. So if everything came in these freaking Ziploc bags, it'd be a happier world. All right, thanks for tuning in everyone. Stay funky and I'll see you next time. Sam time, signing off. Subscribe today! Punk it down! Alright, back to the cables. Now, poop my pants and do a little disco dance. A tangled mess of sadness. Ugh, Medusa's hair. Maybe that's how they made this cable. Hercules chopped the multi-dongle Hydra. Look, 